Hello, I am Hanni Audere and I am a musician from Finland, Northern Europe. I'm going to start a new series here on my channel and I'm going to show you beautiful places in the Finnish nature. One of the places I like the most is the forest. I go there to feel connected with the nature and to feel something sacred. I go there sometimes alone or I prefer going there also with my friends or my family. And also I will show you what, what kind of things people usually do there. So welcome to have a look at the Finnish nature. On this video I'm going to take you to see a place that is very dear to me. Finland is located in the northern Europe. Forests cover about 78% of Finland's surface area. They are an essential part of the Finnish soulscape. They are also our most important natural resource. We don't have mountains, but we have tens of thousands of lakes and lots of forests. These are the footprints of a squirrel and probably a mouse. On this frozen river, there's probably been a fox. As you notice from my uncertainty, I'm not exactly a zoologist. Well, here the right one is a human, but the left one, I don't know, maybe a fox again. As many as over 800 of the species are endangered. Almost 80% of the forest types are in danger. Most of the Finnish forests are actually planted tree fields, since forestry is one of the biggest industries in Finland. That white area is where the path normally goes. It's so great to walk on an untouched snow. The most common trees are spruce and pine. The oldest spruces can grow even up to 40 meters here and pines well over 30 meters tall. This is where I had to look very carefully where to go because at first I didn't recognize the spot at all. That's because the trees had bent over the path. We did our best to walk all the way without touching the trees because they were so beautiful as they were. In a way I'm a typical Finnish person because I enjoy being in the nature without seeing anybody else except the people who happen to be with me. I love the silence where I can only hear birds and the wind and my own breathing. I'm especially in love with narrow paths. I also love the feeling that at the end of the day I'm a really small part of the nature, literally. That gives a healthy perspective to us humans. Here I'm climbing a rock. The trees are much smaller on the top of it. It was insanely beautiful everywhere with no signs of humans. I felt bad about making footsteps on the path and again tried hard not to disturb the sleeping trees. Going into the nature is something very Finnish. I love especially the sound and the scents of the forest. I'm showing my love uh, of nature by respecting every stone, every tree, animal, every root. In some places there was snow almost up to my knee. I had good warm shoes and long woolen socks, so I didn't mind at all. My pulse went up as I climbed up the hills and rocks and crawled under the snowy branches. It was also quite tough to walk in the deep snow. This is how my shoes and socks looked like. Didn't mind that either. I just felt so happy. For many of us, all kinds of forests are very important places for relaxing and feeling connected to the nature. The Finns go there to pick berries, 
do some sports or just look around and breathe. Skiing is something we start to learn when we are about five years old. Basically everybody gets to ski in school and many children learn this skill even before that. Yeah, that's me looking so dynamic with my quilted jacket. I'm mostly enjoying the views and taking pictures. It took an hour for me to ski about five kilometers because I just couldn't stop looking at the beauty all around me. Just came up from there and look at this place. Unfortunately, I can hear some cars. There is a road nearby. It really, really beautiful. I'm so happy. Here we go. Being in the forest gives me energy and peace of mind. This is essential for my work as a musician and a composer. I have many compositions that speak about nature in different ways. Like Puhun puille, I talk to the trees. To be able to create music, one has to have room for new thoughts and different angles and point of views. New musical inventions start to sound in the mind in silence. It's also very important to feel relaxed because that's when creativity gets stronger. No wonder that a lot of art is born in several ways out of nature. Winter is not like this always, every year and uh, every part of Finland. But we are lucky to have this beautiful winter this year. I think it's important for us all to do our best to save the clean and unique nature for future generations. The Finnish landscapes are beautiful in every time of the year. I will show you also how the springtime looks like in the local forest. But before that, some more skiing and walking in the calm, sleeping forest. If you like the content, Feel free to subscribe and also tell your friends about this channel. I appreciate every comment and all the support I am, I am getting from you. I'm so happy and thankful that you are doing all this together with me.